Early morning found us waiting for the sunrise on the boardwalk at Urunga. The morning was chilly with a strong wind and the outgoing tide was running strong at the river mouth where the apex predator, the white-bellied sea eagle, was out to find breakfast. The sun was only just bringing light to the day when he began swooping over the water and we were amazed to see in the dim light what looked like hundreds of fish jumping into its path. The raptor tried again and again to snatch one of the fish from the water, but to no avail. Those fish were leaping everywhere, but it seemed only to confuse the bird. Gulls were diving and still those fish kept leaping high. At some point he got really tired and just headed back to the beach to rest on the sand and gain some strength. Then he took off again to have another try. Skimming the waves, but those fish were still jumping and he wasn't catching any. There are some scientists who say they do this to avoid predators. And another school of thought is that they're trying to shake off parasites. Still other scientific opinion has it that they do this in, or in spawning season to loosen the egg sacs. And another thinks it's to obtain more oxygen. Whatever the reason, it really confused both the sea eagle and us, watching on as some of them reached a height of three feet and then slapped back down onto their sides. The eagle kept trying, the fish kept jumping, but eventually he got very tired. And that's the story of the sea eagle and the mullet on a chilly autumn morning at Nyiranga. <laughs>